Okay, it's currently day five of starting an army in under seven days. Yesterday, we got a ton of stuff done. And when I say a lot, I mean like a lot, a lot, okay? But today, we need to do a lot more because I told my Discord server that I might launch the game today at 2 p.m. Eastern Standard Time. And right now, it is 2 p.m. So <laughs> I don't really know what I'm gonna do because there's still a lot of stuff that needs to be done to the game. And I said that I wouldn't work on too much off camera, but I kinda needed to. It wasn't fun stuff, so don't worry. You should literally be thanking me, okay? Like, I'm sure you guys don't wanna see someone make clothing for two hours so i'm gonna quickly run through what happened yesterday after i stopped recording that way it like doesn't surprise you guys when you see stuff all right so first thing basically this guy hit me up he was asking if we needed clothing and i was like yeah we do so i asked for his previous work he sent me this looks pretty nice so I asked him how fast he was able to do it because, you know, we're on a time limit. And he said one to two days. So I was like, okay, okay. And then after a day or so, he sent me the final products. They look like this, which I'm super happy about. So over here is the physical training. This is the officer um, formal thing. And then this is the enlisted formals. And then over here is the combat uniform, okay? Okay, so let's buy this right now. All right, oh, 100,000? Is this seriously a hundred thousand? I did not, I did not agree to this. What the? Okay, so he fixed it, and the total is supposed to be like one point five thousand. But I told him just to make it two thousand, so I'm just gonna give him like a little tip or something. So let's go ahead and buy. The okay, I literally just gave myself funds. Let me refresh. All right, there we go. Purchase complete. All right, so I'm gonna put the clothing on the group and into the game. But before I do that, there's another thing that happened off camera. Okay. Basically, this guy hit me up. He's like, hey, I'm a GFX designer. Do you want one? So these are his past examples, and they look really nice. I really like this one. I don't know why. Okay, but anyways, he was working on it, and he messaged me, and he finished with the GFX. This is the final product. It looks really nice. So I went ahead and asked him if he was willing to make a group logo and a game logo. And then I was going to pay for everything because he originally said that he didn't want pay. And like, he's spending his time on this. So like, I have to pay him. So if he's willing to make me the game logos, then it'll probably be done by day six. So I'll show you guys that then. So that's basically all that happened off camera. So now let's get into what we're going to do today. So the first thing that we need to get done is the uniform givers. I'm just gonna use the ones from my Canadian army because I think they're pretty good. So we're gonna copy this and then paste it. Okay, I don't know where it is, one second. <laughs> okay, I found them. I don't know why they're in the water, but we'll go ahead and move these to the uniform room. Okay, so locker room is this way. Let's put these in here. Okay, wait, I actually need like the clothing rack. So I'm gonna copy that paste it in the game we'll put this like right here should be fine maybe now let's get the physical and the formal uniform okay paste that and then let's just put this one right there and then for the formal uniform let's take this copy that and then let's put it right here okay and then also let's grab these hair models and then put it in the game that way people can customize their avatar as they wish. So let's go ahead and put these on these tables. If it rotates properly. All right, there we go. All right, there we go. Let's drag this into the corner. And then we're also going to add some hair over here on this table. So this is going to be the uniform room. It's very tiny, but it'll have to do. So all we have to do is change some scripts to make it match the U.S. Army. And then the uniform room should be done. All right, let me upload the clothing that he sent me. And then I'll put it in the game. All right, let's go ahead and upload them to the group. Okay, we have the camo shirt first. We'll name this combat uniform. Okay, upload this. And then let's upload the formal shirt. All right, we'll name this officer service uniform. Form. Next is the physical training shirt. So let's name this physical 
training shirt. All right, now for the pants. Let's upload all of them. All right, boom. We uploaded all of them. All right, let's go test if it works. That took way longer than it should have. <laughs> but um, hopefully this works. All right, boom. It does work. Okay, look at me. I'm so, I'm so cute. Oh, my God. Let's see if the hair works. Oh, it does. Okay. I'm going to add, like, a hat remover, like, right here. That way I can, like, get rid of this stupid hair. But, um, yeah, the uniforms work. All right, so let's move on to the second thing that we're going to do today. All right, so now what we're going to do is come up with the Game Pass prices. I don't want to make them too high, but I also don't want to make them too low. So we're going to meet somewhere in between, and hopefully we can come up with a good price. So first up, we have the Glock. Um... Okay, I think I'm gonna make the Glock like 149 Robux. That's pretty fair. So let's save this. Okay, on to the next one. HK416. Okay, this gun is really good. So, so this might have to be like pretty high. We'll make this 499 for now. I might need to change that. All right, AR15. Again, amazing weapon. We'll go ahead and make this 399. All right, next up is AK-47. Pretty good gun. We'll make this $299. All right, M4A1. Decent gun. We'll make this $249. Entry pass. We'll make this just $49. Bongos. We will make this... We'll make this $69. All right. Private second class. Okay. We'll make this just $199 because it's just basically just skipping basic training it's nothing special next up is e4a army specialist this is a pretty high rank so we'll make this 399 and then finally e5 sergeant we will do 699 all right that's all the game passes for now i'll probably change the prices later but for now this is okay all right next up we have badge icons I'm gonna make them similar to this, like I have it in my Canadian army. So let's go ahead and open Photoshop. All right, so I just finished making all the badges. I kinda forgot to hit record, but um, I made them. <laughs> so we have joined the army here. We have completed basic training. We have become a US army officer. We have met the owner. And then finally we have joined a division. So I already uploaded them and they're just processing now. Roblox has to accept them. So while they're uploading, I'm going to do the next thing for today. Yesterday, I gave my staff a template that they had to fill out for the regiment. So they're all done with that. So I'm going to go ahead and upload it to the groups. That way the army just looks more professional. So let's open all the groups. All right, first up is intelligence command. Let's configure group. Paste that there. All right, perfect. Let's save it and let's go to the next group. Next up, Medical Corps. All right, boom, we have this here. Let's save this and then let's go to Force Com. All right, boom, save this. Okay, so the final thing on the list is making the description for the game. That way it catches people's eye and this just looks so boring without it. So let's go ahead and go to configure this place. All right, so first we're gonna put like an American Eagle. So we're gonna press Windows key and period and it'll bring up like an emoji list. I never knew about this until like a year ago and I can't stop using it now. So we're gonna search up Eagle and then we're gonna get like a special font generator because I think it'll look a lot nicer. All right, this one right here, we'll put United States Army. Okay, let's see which one looks good. Okay, okay, what does that even say? There's no way people can even read this. What the heck? We're gonna use this one right here because it looks the best. All right, we'll put that there. And also an eagle on the other side, okay. We'll put like a little pin over here. And we're gonna put the word information right there, but in special font, of course. All right, this one right here. And then we're gonna put another line thing right there. And then we're gonna put like a little shopping cart. And then we're gonna put the word store right here and then we're gonna get like a barrier thing and we're gonna put credits this is basically just gonna be like for the developers of the game because it's always nice to give credits to people okay so i'm gonna fill out these categories and then i think that's gonna be it for today all right for the store category we're gonna do many good deals in the store tab 
go ahead and check them out. Okay. And then for the credits, we're going to do SK1NF. This is the builder. We're going to put main builder. And then, yeah, that's basically it. <laughs> All right, so I'm going to go ahead and publish this. And then I'll see you guys on day six.